okay today we'll see the first experiment that is memory transfer of microcontroller subject <coughs> in that first go to key software whenever you click on key that is micro version go to project new micro version project is generated you have to give the project name save that now select the i see that i see either grow from h051 microcontroller nxp or you directly give here p89 v51 rd2 select that i see and click on okay now at project window project name is displayed and target one click on right click on that go to option here set the crystal frequency that is 11.0592 megahertz and uh, in output create a hex file and click on ok button after that go to file and new whenever you click on new button text one is generated here type the program type that program origin mu dptr comma hash 100h that 100h is address start starting address of dptr then whatever value is there 30h that is loaded into r0 08 is loaded into r7 then clear the accumulator first accumulator plus dptr value is loaded into accumulator again in dptr that is at the address 100h we store some data that is 32h 34h ff h 0 bc 22 33 44 8 bit data is there that stored into dptr and dptr and accumulator that is indirect value is loaded into accumulator and that accumulator value is again loaded into indirectly to r0 resistor when goes on increasing that dptr value means first 32h value is loaded into that dptr that value is added with accumulator and that data is loaded with accumulator again okay and accumulator value is stored into register that is memory transfer from one register to another register then next value goes on increasing so increment dptr at that time register value is also increased so increment r0 eight values are there so decrement r7 okay and move into that loop till eight bits will be there after that save save that program we are writing that program into assembly language so extension of that is 
प्लीज रिमेम्बर सेव बाय डॉट एस एम नाउ इन प्लस साइन क्लिक ऑन दैट सोर्स ग्रुप विल बी जनरेटेड देन राइट क्लिक ऑन सोर्स ग्रुप एंड एक्जिस्टिंग फाइल और न्यू फाइल इज देयर क्लिक ऑन एड एक्जिस्टिंग फाइल यू एड दैट वॉट एवर फाइल इज स्टोर्ड इन टू टारगेट वन सेलेक्ट दैट डॉट ए एस एम फाइल एड दैट फाइल इन टू सोर्स ग्रुप वेन एवर यू एड दैट यूर प्लस सिंबल इज देयर क्लिक ऑन दैट प्लस सिंबल इफ देर इज एन एरर देर इज क्रॉस सिंबल विल बी generated otherwise no error will be there so after that goes translate option is there so translate whenever you click on that first block otherwise you go from project here also translate that build target is also there so click on that translate whenever you click on that or control seven f7 is also there whenever you click on that translate here if error is there it shows that error or warnings but in this program there is no error after that go to build click on that build button after that click on batch build okay then go to debug now whenever you start debugging whatever value stored into your memory i select here memory 1 address is 100h that value is already stored 32h 34h ff bc and okay <clears throat> now click on that step f1 or step that is step one line or you select step over so select one by one dptr value shows here that address line 100 whenever you click on register that is 30h is there again move that r7 that value is 8 again accumulator whatever value is stored that 32 is stored into accumulator first okay so accumulator and whenever you click on that dptr value that is goes on increasing at the same moment that register value is also goes on increasing and r7 value is goes on decreasing like that dptr value is increased okay if i want to see the values of r0 h and whatever values are stored into dptr that value is loaded into that r0 goes on increasing whenever you goes on increasing
that R0 and DPTR value is goes on increasing at the same time R7 is that value goes on decreasing. And at the end, whenever R0 becomes 0, R7 becomes 0 means stop debugging. Okay, means all values are stored into register R0. That's all. Thank you very much. That is the program for memory transfer.